Ascending? Yeah, ascending and descending. Double leg, it's like doing the same. <laughs> okay. Let's see, you do, you do three maybe. Do a single, single leg first. Starting from the left leg. Mm -hmm. Sure. Taking the chi here, and then um, leave, leave the, mm -hmm. the hand on the stomach, mm -hmm. and then turning, then descending. And if you can reach at the to foot, imagine that you can go far further. Last one. Okay. out so this front will close like this. Thank you. okay okay the yeah let's do the second one the yeah not the, the other one grinding the, yeah the belt okay. yeah belt meridian grinding yeah. okay. and you start at the left mm -hmm. small grinding is 180 degrees yes yeah. so again in this case when you 180 degrees, you imagine you're here, the hands can only be like this. That's the threshold that you create in your mind. But physically, there isn't anything behind you, right? Okay. And when you finish, you have to stay a bit of the, yeah. the dance and yeah. start again. Mm -hmm. They eventually will do that, but if I break the movement, okay. When you are doing these moves, one thing that we should rem add is that try to put a ball in between your legs. Maybe a small one. Meaning, yeah, yeah. Meaning, watch. Okay. When you are turning, try to turn like this. Don't turn like this. Oh, it's not okay. It's not the waist. It's, it's yeah, it's like don't catch yourself like this. Try to turn like this, so that there is opening here. It's a big ball. It's small, small. Just as long as this does not get caught. Yeah. Instead of doing shortening your legs. Yeah. Doing yeah. It, or if you wider. Wider. That's why. I'll you explain a little bit of the belt meridian. Now. Okay. So this is the purpose. Okay. Oh, you did that one yeah. already. Okay, thank you. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and uh, yeah, number number eleven. Through the knees into yeah. your feet. Basically, there are ten exercises, but it's a twelve exercise Shigong system, and okay. the number eleven, the number nine times at the bottom here. Stop. It's very important. Excuse me. I'll add this. It's very important at the end here. The threshold is that the hands are straight. They have to curve. Started by this, this curve. And do not do this. Do not start the curve with your hand. Okay. So it's very important the curve has to occur inside. So here, straight. It has to become a curve because of the internal movement. It can't be that you make a curve. You, you, will, you will realize, once you understand this, you start looking at high-level masters, old times, old footage. You'll see that old masters all move like this, not like this. And, but if you're not careful, you, you, will see, you, will, you will remember this. How come I used to think his hands were like this? Now I look carefully, it's like this. It never moves. 
So your hand never moves until you move so naturally, everybody believes your hand moves. Bring the energy back to center. Pressing down. Towards the center again. Reversing the hand. Moving your back and so we'll do this another time. Okay. And on the last one. is a lift. That's it. Here. And then you can go high. Shoulders. Everything drop. And back up. Okay. Very good. Sit down. Completely relax. Okay. And then with the left hand on your right, the bow gun. Again, uh, finding your center, concentrating on the chi, looking at it, listening to the heat, looking at it, looking for the color, readjusting, do a circle if it's necessary to find out where you are, your center. And then making sure that you're relaxing completely. Uchi. And then uh, opening up your arm. Uh, we'll start with the right. And here it's like if we are swimming, just bring it back to the Dantian, keeping the ball, the pressure, and then just opening up with the left arm. Mm -hmm. uh, again. Looking at the example of a swimmer, bringing widely, collecting all the energy, bringing it back to the Dantian, keeping the pressure or the energy down, and then opening up with the other arm, straight across, bending, and again the right hand over the left, coming down. Again, positioning yourself, finding the center. And again, looking at the Dantian inside, concentrating, looking, feeling, looking at the temperature, readjusting in a very relaxed fashion. It's in the center here, this here. If you hit this hard, this entire arm is is numb. numb. <laughs> yeah, so really? the, so it's <laughs> like that. So it's not just hit that area hard. You have to be precise. Energy. It's not a, a lie. Okay. It's and not fake. Like you can put the energy yeah. right in your spine. Yeah, you are caught like this. You can't correct it, because especially in the West and with some. Um, in the East, they choose the people who are not very flexible and do this to an area like this. But if you are like this, you can break it. So we have to try to always go like that. Okay. Uh, the next, uh, uh, so again, bending uh -huh. the shoulders, uh -huh. the elbows uh -huh. to break that vibration. Mm -hmm. And then uh, with the arms up. Uh, and shaking the whole body, but near to the dantian. Yeah. Okay. Not the hands, but that yeah. part. And that's what you Golden want to do. Rules. And you're good. good. Yeah.